uh, as far as I am aware, I've never seen the Department of Player Safety, and it seems somewhat ironically titled that, rescind a suspension where a player was injured. Malte in front, one timer scores! Finn Brown from Malte right to the top of the crease. Right after one didn't go in, that one does. And the Bulldogs have struck first, it's one nothing. Yeah, just a good move off the face off there to the front, nobody picked up Finn Brown at all, and uh, he walked in and scored uh, five hole, I think, Hammer. Yeah, it looked to be, was not included on their game day lineup. I had him as a scratch, anyway, Charbonneau. A lot of traffic back in the net, they to try to navigate, ran into it. One timer up front, they score! Wilson on a pass by Jacobs, and the Capitals have tied it at one. A great job by the Capitals behind the Bulldogs net, winning the battles. There was three Bulldog players there, but they couldn't win the battle. Puck came out and Wilson buried it in a big goal for Cowichan Valley. Gray's fan on it, Schofield left wing. Right wing pass, Turin in a big save. Hobie Hedquist on Mateo Turin. Huge stop on the right pad. Bulldogs tail to corner, kicks it in back of the net. Layer flies on the chase and finds it. Reverses it, fire corner. Aired in to support the battle, tried to center, got tied up, just kept fighting after it. Support arrives from Mulady, left point, stepping up, kept in by home. Mulady, deep slot, a pull of his jersey, he scores anyway! Beautiful goal by Cole Mulady. Capital had a hand of a chunk of his jersey, he just kept going, and the Bulldogs have taken the lead again. Wow. You know what? That's strength, but holding in this game has been everywhere. Nobody's getting called for holding. Now it's right down to jersey tugging. <laughs> but anyway, he picked up that puck and just released it. And uh... Second intermission guest, Bulldogs head coach Joe Martin. Wow. So, courtesy of the BCHL oh, podcast with the Jesse Adamson. The league's coordinator of content services. Part one and part two. One and two tonight, tomorrow night, the second. It's great to hear him interviewed by someone else. Right in front of backhand stop. Loose puck scores! They put it in their own net. They did, I believe it's Finn Brown who touched it last for the Bulldogs. Bono was on the scene, made it an adventure. Pardon me, it's Matthew Malte who leads the celebration. Well, the, the Cal Valley defensive. Stamp stopped by Hedquist. Lombardi top of the point, Jacobs. Top of the right circle, Bond. Pad save, Hedquist, they score on the rebound. As Luke Thames jams it through before Hedquist could cover. Shot in a rebound, and it's the third pretty and start. The Capitals wanted it 3 2. Just a shot and a rebound. That's all it takes. Get it out. Chairman will try to throw it out. Hit a bulldog over to Cap. A long shot. Stick save. Hedquist. Far corner. Chairman will hard hit on Lavelle. Nice move, Lombardi. Great save by Hedquist. Down by Ethan Bono. Jacobs. Cross ice pass. Lombardi forced in deep by Fontaine. Try to put it up front, stuff in the tempo is blocked. Loose puck, poke free by Mulady. Down to 13 seconds left. Centering bid, deep slot, Bond. Fan on it, Charbonneau finds it, banks it, clears it. Brandon Beer chases after it. Down to three seconds left. And the Alberni Valley Bulldogs have a three nothing series lead wow. with a three two is win. This hockey though. Oh. Bulldogs are saluting their fans that came down and packed a couple of sections on the road, which is a very cool moment to see. For sure. Um, that one's for you, Zary, and uh, hopefully you get better soon. And uh, wow, three games, they're all been pretty close. And uh, Cowichan gave it their best too. But uh, in the end, the dogs' uh, depth, I think, really uh, is one and again.